A Day in the Life of an Atlantean Citizen Leisure Recreational activities in such a world, where ZPE is only regulated after the fact, where free will can reign in total control over whole s large sections of our shared material universe, etc., largely revolve around more purely aesthetic, art for art's sake, pursuits of creativity such as satire and statistics. Nature is seen as a place to experiment with the existing, to remix it from one place with alike kinds from somewhere else, and to see what yields the most pleasing result. Bonsai botany trims the asymptotically bifurcating branches of the infinite, possible future realities in the so-called garden of forking paths, such that the shape taken by each root, the trunk, every branch, stick, stem, twig, and leaf is perfectly in harmonic accord with the plans of the one whose hands hold the pruning knife. Just so, the exertion of energy for its own sake is seen among psychics as resulting from the boredom of the sex drive. When the sex drive is redirected into mental pursuits, it ceases to be blocked in a lower, more physically driven chakra center. In general, because in such a society, work, taxes, voting, and banking would all be voluntary and could be opted out of entirely if one so chose, there is a greater quality of leisure time than work-related or task-specific spending of time. In this sense, because being free means having excess free time, the mind beings of Atlantis are more focused on inspiring creativity in themselves and others than in pursuing any particular sport or game. It is seen as far better to participate in political choices than to play lesser political games.